Far Cry 6. When we left off. I believe we were in the middle of a party, so I don't know what's going to happen now that we load back in. But we are about to find out, so let's jump back into it. Alright. Hola. Playtime's over, Danny. No shit. You all just left me. You're the one who kicked us off our island. Um, I do not remember that. Why would I kick them off? Well, maybe it's because we partied so loud. <laughs> Where are you setting up shop? Thanks to you, at the Gran Hotel Caballero. Swing by soon. McKay and Castillo are already fortifying their poison production operations in La Jolla. You got it. No more parties. That's right. I ended the party. Apparently. Medicine! It'd be a sin not to take this medicine. Alright, let's, uh, <laughs> let's get out of here. Alright, so we gotta meet up with Yelena. Let's see, where is, where is dear Yelena? Mm. You know what? Screw it. We're gonna go do a different mission. I don't want to talk to them anymore. I, I partied, we had fun. It was, it was what it was. Um, we're gonna go... We're gonna do this one. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's zoom in. All the way. Alright, can we flash... Flash. Can we fast travel here? No. Can we fast travel here? See, I want to fast travel as close as possible because I know... I, I, I just... I know how I am with driving. Let's be honest. I'm the best driver. The best Far Cry 6 driver. I, we always get where we need to go. Alright. Yeah, let's go! Oh yeah, I can summon my tank too now. I forgot about that. Makes me happy. Alright. Yes. Or I guess, you know what? I To be honest, I'm probably better at riding a horse than I am a, a vehicle. But, I mean, when you have a tank, you're telling me you're not going to drive it? If any of you, <laughs> I would be shocked if any of you, but if any of you guys own a tank, um, let me know down below if you actually go joyriding in it. I already did here. It's illegal to own a tank in my country. Woohoo! Making it out of here. I don't know what all these this banging noises are, but all right. So, do we need to take a right here? Let's see. Okay, so we can follow this road um, up until we get to the intersection. You want to take a left on the intersection? <laughs> all right. Turn right. No. I wish I had a horn. Wait, is that auto driving? Look, no hands. That's no fun. Come on. Splish splash. We. I'm surprised no one's phoned to me already. Normally by now people have been harassing me. I usually have gotten like two or three phone calls at this point. Not today. Not today. I feel like it needs to be some sort of like opera playing while I drive this tank. Alright. Kaboom! Aw, I wish it would have break the, the gravel a little. That'd be really cool. Alright, 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 alright. Let's park our tank like a reasonable individual. Did I actually pull it off? I'm about to be very impressed with myself. <gasps> oh, I better get a like on the video for that one. I'm just saying. Oh, man. I'm even in the lines. Ah, it's perfect. All right. 
This video is off to a great start. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys hey I need to talk to you about something so my car broke off down the road that's right that's right okay I will say they they reacted exactly how I hoped they would react which is not what I was expecting I really expected them to uh like shoot me on sight like what normally happens not today though i parked good i oh wait this isn't even where we're supposed to go ah of course oh you know what at least i parked my tank right that's all that's all that matters we'll walk the rest of the way we're used to that all right here we go let's hope we don't see another one of those crazy uh crocodile adventures like last time dun, 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 dun. Whoa, my lighting just changed. Sometimes this room is weird. Lights flicker, lights turn on and off. Glasses move across the room. I know what you're thinking. It's haunted! No, it's not haunted. It's just poorly made. <laughs> it's a poorly made room. Alright. Uh, just in case, let's put these away. Hola, my friends. You enjoying that? Um, well, apparently you're not enjoying it if you're just going to throw it on the ground and litter. <laughs> you and your aviators. He's like, no one mess with me. I throw my drink on the ground. I litter. I don't care about it. Let's make me some money. Let's make me some money? Or just get me a PPSH? I'd be happy with that, too. All right. Cool story, bro. You are such a poet. All right, when the boat leaves, the boat leaves. All right, so now we got to go all the way over here. You know what? We are not going to take the um, tank all the way there. We're going to fast travel. Yeah, there we go. Now we will... T well, actually, we won't have the tank when we're here. But we'll summon the car and drive the rest of the way. We'll be fine. All right, someone please bring me my vehicle. Spoke to our mutual friend, Bembe. What did that snake have to say? He says I do this one last dirty job for him. You walk away clean. I'm not proud, but I do it again to get Talia and me out of Yara. Danny, I know the risk you are taking for me. I won't forget this. Like me if I get through this in one piece. Hmm. So you know what? I'm not happy with the driver. He took my car around the wrong block. You know what? I'm not going to punch... I'm not going to shoot you, but I am going to... Wait, how do I... I wanted to punch him. I didn't want to machete him. That was a little overkill. I right, got canceled over the goat. I don't need to get canceled. <laughs> I don't need to get canceled over that guy. Vladimir does not like drivers. He attacks drivers on sight. Oh, jeez. He attacks drivers. We Here we go. Whoa! Got some air on that one. <laughs> See, I I need to be... Wait, is there a... Oh, Lord. Well, we made it. We made it over the mountain in one piece. See, I would be really good at... Well, actually, maybe I'd be really bad. Like those um, taxi games? Never played one. <laughs> it probably would be funny to see. All right, here we go. Choo choo! Oh, and my controller is about to die. My controller died. I think that that car crash actually sucked the life out of my controller. All right, that's okay. We can walk. If my controller dies, I can just run away and grab a new one. Bingo! Military's got them. I think my backup one is charged. Hopefully. Bembe, why is it everywhere you send me, I find trouble? Speculation is a waste of time. And time is money. Take matters into your own hands, Rojas. And fast. Rafael is there somewhere. You saw nothing. Okay, so can I go in here? No, I can't. Dang it. 
Looks like this we're gonna have to go live. It has got to be Raphael. Hostage. Wow, I'm really scared of your barrier. Okay, I'm, I'm scared of your gun, though. Well, I was hoping that would go as easy as... Like, I took out the sergeant pretty quickly, but this guy, this clown... Hello. Sorry about the trouble. Now he won't come back as a zombie. Help you, but there's people over there in the tower. You see that guy? He's gonna try to snipe me. Okay, you're you're more of a problem. You know, they're, they're starting to strategize, guys. We're in trouble. He was almost an even match. He tried to chuck something at me, too. But I won. Alright. Hi. Oh, crap. Where are you? Where are you? Well, I... There you are. I'll help you in a moment. And you know what? I have a bone to pick with you in a second. Okay, so. You're the one that keeps asking me to help you, right? Yeah, you are. You definitely are. So, I almost... Wait, did I hear someone walking? No. No, look. I, was, I would help you, but here's my problem with this. You are standing out here in the open. There was snipers, all these guys. You saw me fighting them, and you still stood here. You all should have run into that building right there, and then I would have come in and helped you, because you guys would have been at least a little safer than standing out here in the line of fire. Yeah, keep telling yourself that. I don't think you guys are going to survive the year. Yeah, you, you're insane, lady. So now you can run away. Oh my gosh. I'll help you, don't worry. You're maybe, like, for you, like, are your ankles tied? No, you could have run too. Yeah, yeah, de nada. Oh, I know. They're just hanging out in the middle of the middle of the area. Ooh, ice cream? I don't know what that means, but it is ice cream. I can get gasoline from the ice cream. Okay, I've never heard of gasoline ice cream, but that can't be healthy. I don't want it. Just walk away, please. This is the most embarrassing rescue I've ever had to do. Alright, let's go talk to Raphael. Over here. Yeah, I'm looking at you. Anything else you want to tell me? Watch out. There might have been something hiding in that plant. Alright. You're welcome. It was probably a rat. Are you Raphael? I got papers for you. Papers? I'm against that. You better hurry. What about you? I'm going back to my studio. I have more art to create. More art to create? Then they, I got I'm an artist too, my friend. And your papers from Raphael. Okay, Ross. Now, make sure my precious cargo gets to the port. See. Si. Okay. All right, let's go to his precious cargo. First, can we loot? No, this is shut. Ooh, boxes of stuff. <laughs> Always look both ways on crossing train tracks. These people are violating the law. Hey, you! You. Fresh meat? Fresh meat? The f did you say to me? Just what we need. You know what? I if you guys were enemies, I would have would have taken you guys out because you guys are violating the law. Pay the court a fine or serve your sentence. Ooh, tank. Well, we got to do this first. Grand. Oh, I can't read it. Everyone, good back there. 
Wait, is that, did all those people we rescued, did they get into the into this whatever we're getting? Yeah. Of some sort? Yeah. Oh no. I'm in the truck. Boss waiting. Try not to damage the goods. Oh no. Goods. This is not the mission for me. No, Danny. That's a truck full of money. My Wait, money. where am I taking these people? Where are... I may not be okay with this. Depending on where exactly we are taking them. I don't like to refer to people as money. Come on. You're just trying to leave? Oh, you're just trying to get, escape the country? Well, you know, we're making this country a better place. If you uh, stick around and maybe help. Get out of the way! We're just going to drive along. Nothing happened. Nothing happened. Are we going the right way? Yes, we are. Oh man, something stuck in the tire. Hope not. I know, I know. Oh, I can honk too. Okay, here we go. Cutscene time. Papers. Wait a minute. Christmas trees? Do we even grow those here? Mexicans pay crazy money for these. How do you think El Presidente Juan de Maria is okay? Okay. Go for it. Haha. <laughs> He's not a good guard. Just our luck. Then they better be here. Hmm. Apparently, I no longer have a timer, which means the boat is not is, is just going to wait now. They, they're like, you know what? We were going to leave on a schedule, but now that the people pulled in, we're just going to wait as long as those people need to get here. But if they didn't show up, we were going to leave without them. Fair enough, fair enough. Almost there to the boat. Almost there. Keep it steady. Almost there. We got it. He missed. You do beautiful work, Rojas. I'm sure our friends here will be very appreciative. You know, if we're, ah, I'm hoping we're just. Amigos. This isn't much stuff. Get going, though. They're not going. Business expense. The fuck does that mean? My talent is commerce, Rojas. Why don't you leave that part to me, and you can focus on your talents? Run back and tell Paolo he has my permission to leave. Vaya con Dios. Hmm. You know. I don't trust this guy. At first, I think that he is doing what I originally suspected might be happening. I was hoping we were just helping them get get somewhere safer, but. Paolo, good news. Bembe's doctor back. That was one hell of a debt you owed. Gracias, Danny. We keep this between us. Dalia hates everything Bembe represents. Well. I'm trespassing. Okay, we got we did that mission, so that's good. Next we go to do this one. Alright, we can fast travel here for that one, so that's good. That's good. Definitely happy about that. I don't know how I feel about that mission, guys. I feel like we um may have just uh, abetted in some uh some unsavory things. I know Paolo's got a lot going on with the cat. We need all hands on deck. Wait, 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 wait. I'm supposed to talk to someone here. The third person thing throws me off every time. You better be ready to fight. What are you selling? What are you buying? Construction desk. Oh, I can build things? I did not realize this. I'm gonna cost up okay. Wingsuit. Load up with gear weapons. Huh. Do I want to spend this stuff on it? I don't think I want to help this area. I'm not a big fan of this camp yet. 
Is there a gaming symbol in there? I'm gonna play it. I know it's me, Vlad of Media. I know you've been waiting to meet me. But first, I must read this note. Hello, my name is B Show, and welcome to the first track show. Welcome to the hot take show. Welcome, welcome to the truth show, where you show me your truth. Show me your truth show. Welcome to rap radio, rap radio, radio rap, where we talk about the hard truth, where we talk about your rap and truth. Bro, bro, you gotta work on your raps. They're not good. No offense, but what is this? Oh gosh, those are people from previous games. I played, I, I did play the one with him. I did not play the one with that guy. I did play that one. Alright. Doesn't look like there's much else in here. <gasps> can we jump? Oh, we can't jump. Oh, I can get up on it though, but I can't jump on it. I was hoping to jump on the bed, but... Beep, beep. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can talk to me. What you want to tell me? you know, I'm a badass radio DJ. Okay, that's a lie. But you... Yes! Oh, I can't wait to tell you and Paulo see this shit. What shit? What are we doing? We're gonna make radio happen. For, uh, Step one. Oh, it's really? Vandalism? Okay. Alright, whatever. That's how we're gonna accomplish our goals. That may not look best... That may look not look great on the history books, but... We'll write them. We'll write them ourselves. We'll just... We'll just, uh... Take that part out. That's how it works, right? Whee! Tank time. Actually, let's see where we're going first before we whip out the tank. Oh, we. Oh, wah. Looks like we are driving. So, you know what? We're going to take the horse this time. We have two horses. So, we take Yarin. Uh, which one do we want? I will take the. Wait, does it have a. Has tattoos? Or is that like. I guess it's tattoos. That doesn't seem uh, very. Uh, hey, horse. Ready to go. Nice to do to the horse. I'm sure the horse totally wanted this yeah. tattoo. Don't and it's worry. like the horse did. Friend. Proud of his tattoos. Hey, quit horsing around. Stop dancing. We gotta go. Can you climb up mountains? Are you like, uh, whoa? No, go higher. Oh man, horse. Come on, horse. Don't you complain to me. This is fun. Watch out! Don't want to decapitate you. Oh, you go complain to someone else about it. This horse is like, you know what? You're be. I, I doubt. At first they tattoo me. Now I have to ride with you. Out of the way. Sorry. Sorry. To, oh no. That didn't happen. Nothing happened. We just um. That dog got bit by a bee. It was really horrible. I I, I don't know if you saw it, but the bee stung the dog, and um, I feel really bad for that dog. Here we go. Here we go. Ah, water. Hard left. Hard right. Quick to stop bird! Alright, here we go. Alright, let's take a shortcut. I prefer the tank, to be honest. Although I feel like I am much more coordinated with No, you can do it. Do it. Do it. The car would do it. There we go. Let's do it. Come on, horse. Don't fight me on it. Let's just let it have just get down off this mountain. Come on. All right, there we go. All right, you know what? This is the last time we take the horse because the horse doesn't want to cooperate with my um, non-barrier or my uh, non-road following. All right, here we go. hee -haw! Watch out, it's a car! Whoa. You hit my horse! You... You committed a crime. Oh shit. Truck. No, they murdered my horse. You didn't see. They just pulled out right in front of it. All right. Uh 
am I coughing on? Danny, you're gonna stop smoking. <clears throat> I got away. I can't believe they killed my horse like that. It's kind of BS if you ask me. What's this country come to when people can just run over your horse in the middle of the road and then they get mad when you shoot at their gas tank? I think I lost them. <laughs> you think? Swimming! Any fish I can catch down here? No. Sad face. Alright. The adventures of Danny running... Oh, there's a horse. Hi. Suerte. Do you mind if I take your horse? Coño. Tali and Paolo are either fighting or Good fucking. Girls. Oh, oh, wow, well... Thanks for the uh, gossip. I didn't ask for it, but... Hey, don't you dare whip out that RPG towards me. I've... Who are you? New recruit, eh? Oh. Really? Two episodes in a row we're going to see a gator fight? Alright. I'm voting for the gator this time because... Luck... You know what? Let's see. Oh my god, you almost shot your horse! <gasps> gator, use tackle! I mean, bite! Horse is trying to flee. Oh no. Oh. oh no. This is getting way out of hand. I should have known. As soon as that gator came out of nowhere. It's... Oh no. This is getting... Don't, don't hide by me. Oh. I'm sorry for your loss. Rest in peace. Let's just casually move past this area. I don't want to, uh... Yeah, I don't want to be involved in this. Rest in peace. Alright. Oh my... What is going on? I, I gotta get out of here. Stuff hits the fan. Wait, wait, wait a second! Isn't this where we... This is the last... Isn't this the spot where we saw the, the last gator fight? I got Was that his wife? Oh, man. The adventure continues. Man, that is horrible. Four gators. The adventure of Crocodilia. That's, that was his wife's name. Crocodilia. And, uh... And the husband's name is um, Dr. Croctopus. Dr. Croctopus, yeah, there we go. Oye, bicho. Una segunda. It's like Cecilia, but. Anyway. I swear to God, bicho. What you waiting for? Spray the posters, plant the bombs, get the fucking word out. Radio Libertad is waiting to be born. Corre, chop, chop. All right. New photos. Okay, so I gotta find those. There's one up there. Can I get that one? Or does that one not count? Man, I'm really uh, traumatized by that... Um, that violence we just witnessed for poor alligators. How do I paint them? Hello, my friend. Tired? You know, there's a hotel over there. You can go get a nap. I wasn't suggesting... I was just saying get a nap. I wasn't suggesting anything further. Good lord, the people in here. It's like they've... That's right. Haha. -ha. Arrest me now, bitch. I don't want to know what that was. It sounded like... All I'm... It's like he thought I was coming on to him or something. I was not. Ah! Haha, <laughs> 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 kicked down me. They call me the graffiti master. 
Okay, so it looks like there's more over here somewhere. Um, over here. Am I supposed to do these? No? Hmm. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool beans. Speaking of cool beans, so... <laughs> My uh, my my younger brother was telling me the other day that kids nowadays say bet to mean cool or something. It's like it's like uh, instead of saying like oh cool, it's oh bet or that's bet. And uh, I've been overusing it to annoy the hell out of him. He's if he if he watches this, he's gonna he, now he's gonna know the truth's out. But I've been using it in like all the different forms that uh, you wouldn't use it in just to annoy him. So, uh, I've been saying bet beans instead of cool beans, so I'm like, bet beans, bruh, and he's like, you're using it wrong. Uh, I'm not going to stop. All right. Ministry of Defense. Due to the volume of outcast activity, all residents of the Junipero neighborhood will be removed by FND forces and taken to a processing center for assessment. On March 4th at noon, this will be considered a military zone. Repopulation of residences will commence following a comprehensive security sweep. No person shall enter, remain, or live in the zone stated above without express written permission from the government of Yara. Any person who fails to comply with this order or any provisions of it, or, is, or who is found in this restricted area after March 4th at noon, will be subject to criminal punishment, regardless of involvement or lack thereof in outcast activities. Thank you and good night. Okay, there we go. Read the note. Okay, so there's something over here I gotta search for. Trash cans. Okay, uh, maybe I should actually read the notes. Let me read your objectives for once. Hey. Sorry, but I knew you were gonna attack me for no reason, so I had to get on it first. Pew! They have a snack stand? What are they selling? Frijoles? Are those... What are frijoles? Is that like jelly beans? I will happily have some jelly beans if that's what those are supposed to be. That's like my favorite candy of all time. I haven't had it in a while either. You need cover? Don't mind me. I'm just looking for a trash can. He said he's looking for a trash can. Why is he looking for a trash can? Oh, I'm putting a bomb, apparently. Just throwing out some trash. Oh, wow. We'll so, so there's nothing in there but the... Wow. Okay, well, that's not suspicious at all. <laughs> Bombs away. Whee! All right, next one. He's doing what I would do. Just whistle, whistle casually. I'm not, not doing anything. Don't worry about me. I'm just a fellow human doing... I mean, a, a fellow pedestrian doing nothing. Aha. I can climb. How do I get up on the roof? <gasps> Stop shooting me. Ah! No grenade, no grenade, no grenade, no grenade. Ah, I was hoping there wouldn't be someone around the corner. Keep the change, a filthy animal. Hi, I showed myself. All right, how do I get up on that roof again? <laughs> apparently, so I, I was talking to someone who was watching my content. And they were telling me that uh, apparently I, I'm too nonchalant about how I fight enemies. <laughs> you can tell me down below if if, if that's accurate or not. <laughs> I say as I do it. All right. So I don't know how to get up there. I better get back to my graffiti. 
I'm trying, my friend. This isn't Assassin's Creed. I can't just climb a flat wall magically. By, like, finger-tipping the ledges. Um, you know what? That's definitely one up there. Can I just shoot it? I need to paint over it. All right, so I think our only option is to climb up on that crane if we can, and then jump off the roof. That's my best bet. Best bet. Bet beans, bro. Bet beans. Oh, that's a bet beans sign, right? Right. going pretty good so far. Nice go, Just keep those edges clean, okay? I got it, Bicho. Well, I don't love you, my friend. We haven't got to know each other well enough for me to say I love you. Give me some time, though. Maybe one day I will find it in my heart to bestow upon you the love of Vladimiria. Alright. Is this the right roof? Yes. Uh, did I make it? Yes, I made it. Good. That was close. Alright. Okay, there we go. I, I like how I can just go, and then I somehow have done all of this. It's awesome. I'm very talented. I like how I kind of float for a moment, as I uh, just so I have time to pull out my chute. Alright, so we have this one, and I think there's one a little bit further back, and I'm guessing those are the last ones we have. I hope. It's the most uh, intense mission ever. Graffiti Masters! Yeah! Alright. I'm good. One more. When you need some graffiti and you don't know how, and it's about a town away, just call up Danny and he'll start to spray today. Danny! Graffiti Danny! Danny Graffiti! Alright. Alright, what's up here? What's up here? Aw, oh, man. You see, Danny was really good at, um, graffiti, but jumping, jumping wasn't his forte. He left jumping to his friend. Come on, Danny, you can do it. Ah, oh, man. Okay. Danny, you suck. Climb, Danny. Danny, this is a really short ledge. Climb. Okay, finally. Alright, so how am I going to get up there? So if I get to that roof, maybe I can jump to that one? We'll try that. Maybe that will work. Get out of the way, you're blocking the road, you two. Yes, Danny, we are getting to your graffiti. Stop telling me. Stop acting like I'm slacking off. I guess we'll just have to take the stairs. Okay, so. I think I got turned around there for a second, but we're fine. We'll make it. This is going to be a close one. Oh, but I can jump to there. Oh, dang it. Dang it, dang it, Danny. You're supposed to be good at this. Just, Danny, you missed the stairs. You're not coordinated enough for this. Danny, come on. He's like, stop saying my name. Oh, you're driving me insane. Danny. Oh, don't be like that, Danny. See, if it wasn't for me, Danny, you would never have made, made it up there. Oh, wait. We don't need to come here. This is where we went before. Okay, well. If only Danny could actually climb. Oh, shoot. Danny just broke his tailbone. 
All right, plan B. We're going to jump off this roof. Surely we can get on top of this roof here. I better get back to my graffiti. Danny? You can't even climb that? Oh, Danny, what are we going to do with you? I don't want to say Danny is incompetent. So I'm not going to. Alright, here we go, here we go. I'm hoping this plan will work. No, oh, Danny, you gotta stand on the on the railing. Yeah, there you go. Now jump and climb! No, he can't. You're not smart enough. Shimmy time. It's like there's I'm sure there's someone watching this right now that's like, there's an easier way up there, you know. Look, I will get up there. I, I, it may not be easy, but I will do it. So I just had to go a little further back, and I would have found the right ladder. Oh, well. All right, here we go. Oh, can we paint? No, it's medicine. It would be us. All right, let's go. Ooh. We can just get this one. Check that there you go. I don't have to worry about the other one. Well, that's that. Now I feel like I have to do the other one. No, 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 man. I wouldn't make You're it. Not done. Are you ready for the next step? I'm ready. Okay, so Maria's on her way. There's a banner she's gonna unveil on live TV. And you are gonna swap it out for our banner instead. Oh, yeah, am, am I? It's high up, but you can get there, right? And you, you think Clara's gonna like it? Yo, get out of here. This is illegal. This is restricted airspace. Turn around, you have entered restricted airspace. They have guns! Where's the crane? Come on, Danny, climb the the barbed wire. Oh, Danny. Out of my way, you're blocking me. Ah! Too many. Too many people! Hey. You know what? I won't lie. It, this, uh, this game is a lot more fun when it's not, when you're not, when I'm not getting killed every second like I was before. Oh, this is a bad idea. Exposing myself to that. Chopper. Alright, where are you, Chopper? You've been grounded! Who sees me now? Is there another one? No, it's a bird. It's a plane! It's Spider-Man! Oh no, I almost fell. Watch out, Danny. <laughs> so they unleash dogs on me, but I'm pretty sure the dogs can't climb ladders. So I'm not afraid at all. I don't actually, I actually don't care at all that they said. Banner is swapped. Banner is swapped. Which banner? Bruce! Vito, I can now add vandalism. <gasps> Ooh. Up here, no one can get me. Up here, I see all. Up here, I am above everyone. I am God. Chalk writing on chalkboard. Okay. To my list of capital Wait, chalk writing on chalkboard? <laughs> that looks like a piece of notepad with a lot of words. 
All right. Here we go. We. Well, that was an adventure. I was uh, not expecting all that to happen, but okay. Right, what's up ahead? Are you taking? Did, did you just take a selfie, bro? It's 2022. People don't take selfies anymore. Come on. Are you self-centered or something? Come on. Nina, it's starting. Oh, you're watching the new Vlada Media video? Oh, shame. It's okay, no one watches my videos yet. Any questions before we begin? Maria Mar Minister Marquesa. Marquesa. Are you concerned that How do you respond to rumors that Diego Castillo is your son? I don't. Diego Castillo is the first son of Yara and an example to all true Yaras. Now, it is my pleasure to unveil the construction of the Anton Castillo True Yaren Cultural Center. Okay, let's see it. <laughs> then, meanwhile, the guards are just like... <laughs> they're still like sweat stripping down their face. They're like, we knew he went up on that crane for something, but we didn't go check. <laughs> we should have checked, but we didn't. They're all just sweating and sweating. Oh my god, Danny! We have so much to do! I'm blowing my own fucking mind! <laughs> wow, you sure trolled them. It's funny, because nowadays it's like people troll news or peep news broadcasts and reporters like all the time. So it's like, uh, <laughs> it's not as impactful of a scene. Alright. on the air no but we are so close i can taste it come to my ranch why because i'm there isn't that reason enough so i will say this game is very pretty um it really is at, t at times and uh it kind of makes me feel bad that i like my first episode i think it was the first episode i like saw that like horrible texture like the model placement too high above floating above the ground that was just unfortunate that i saw that then because if i had never seen that i would have been like wow they the game is a I mean, it still is fun so far, but I mean, I mean, um, it would, uh, it would have, I would, but if I hadn't had seen that, I would just, I think I would have, um, it wouldn't have thrown me off a bit at the beginning, because I think seeing that so early kind of like uh, put a bad taste in my mouth. Uh, grab a right. That a taste that's not warranted. Um, that's that's all I'm trying to say. Alright. Don't you honk? It's in my car. Only I'm allowed to press the horn. Ignore that scratch. Me. Yeah, I just did that scratch. <sighs> Clown. Clown world. Alright. Where are we going next? We are going... Alright, so we've helped him, right? Um... Hmm... We're going to the air attacks. Okay, so we need the radios. Yeah, we do need those. That's pretty important. I say we go head there next. This is going to be a fun adventure. We'll see if we make it in one piece. Try to follow the road. Alright. You're going the wrong way! Sorry, it was not me. It was Julie. Like the video if you get got that reference. Ah! All right, you T-boned me. All right, we got to exchange um, license and insurance information. All right, so um, I my insurance is going through Blue Cross Blue Shield. Ah! No. This is illegal. Uh, 
This is illegal. I can't believe they just assaulted me like that. I got out, tried to exchange insurance information. He just opened fires on me. Ah, we gotta make a turn. All right. Hello, truck. Why are you highlighted? Must be important. Hehe, <laughs> I like honking at them. All right. Going over the bridge. Watch out! Choo choo! Boom, get hit by a train. Wouldn't surprise me at this point. Alright, here we go. So, how's your day going? Let me know all about it. I will, res if, if any, every single person, <laughs> if, if any of you tell me how your day is, I will respond to that comment. Um, first person to tell me about their day, I'll put in the top of the comments. Watch out! Well, that person disappeared. They teleported. No, I didn't harm a citizen. The citizen teleported. I harmed the horse. All right, here we go. Beep, beep, beep. Watch out. This is my road. Beep, beep, mother. Wee. Watch out. Don't hit the alarm. That's illegal. Oh, I'm actually pretty close. It's spirit. All right. Cameo. All right. Y'all don't know? Question mark. All right. All right. Can I graffitiize the sign? No. Sadness. But can I blow it up? Nice. You. This is illegal to free to fly here. Wait, did I actually get it? Huh. Come down! This is You're in restricted airspace. Turn back immediately. Or we shall open pew pew at you. can't believe they just are ignoring all my warnings. As if I'm not here. Gone. Hello, cow. Aw, oh, man. Eat something. Do you see all this grass? Come on. Don't you honk at me. It's illegal to honk at me. Do you not realize I am the human player and you are the NPC? Hello. What are you guys sleuthing around for? How's your day going? Are you getting in trouble? Well, are you just gonna stand here or are you gonna talk to me? Fine. Uh, some of these some of these NPCs are so uncivilized. It's like I'm just sitting here wanting to have a conversation with them. It's like, Vlad, you just told them that you were their god, and now you're complaining that they won't talk to you? Shh. Come on. I have to go there. Here we go. Pizza, are you here? Where's the entrance to this gate? All right. Oops, I just alerted them that I'm here. It's like, uh, no, you're yelling alerted them you were here. Congratulations, you're a, a budding on-air personality with big dreams of starting your own radio station. Bringing our island nation more true our content is noble endeavor. But first, you must get a license and a frequency to broadcast. To apply for a frequency and broadcast license, contact the Ministry of Culture. Once you have your license and frequency, you must and you must obtain gear. See page 49 for details on mixing consoles, mics, headphones, and more. Next, you need content for your station. Will you be playing mostly music? Are you running a talk radio station? News? To find your content in a pitch package and submit it to the Ministry of Culture for approval. Okay, okay, 
Okay. Hi-fi. Hi-fi. Where is this hi-fi? Oh, Lord. I do not want that. We're going back to our... Or, or, or MP40. Wait, do I did I just equip two MP40? No, I didn't. I'm good. I'm just. Another note. Remember how badass rock rock bleh. dyslexia. Remember how badass Star Rock Rockets beer was? Well, I've got bad news, company. Instead of that nectar of the hobby gods, the brewery is transitioning to true yarn production of the highest quality. In the tradition of Marcus Rump, Maria's PR is bullshit through Hector got contracted to do some painting in the distillery and her top shit comes from the same barrels as cheap shit. Best buy the, the bone brew we show. Get up on freedom. <laughs> Alright. Oh, it's a treasure map. Eureka! You found the treasure! There's no one here. Oh. Hey, bro. What you watching? Hey, bro. What you doing? Apparently, he's watching that. It's like that moment when you don't realize someone's watching you. He's gonna like scratch his butt or like pick his nose or something. I'm gonna be like, hey, and he's like, oh, hey, uh, I was just, uh, I had an itch. It's like, mm hmm. Almost ready to go. Hey, bro. <laughs> I've been here the whole time. I hope you weren't using that TV. Duarte reporting that Anton Castillo is a soggy sack of shit. This guy's insane. I don't think we should be in his home. Wait, let's look. Let's see if let's let's okay. Let's bring out. So you, some of you guys know I used to teach psychology. I'm gonna try to look at this from a psychological perspective. I'm coming over to do a house check, a, a wellness check. All right. Well, he's got a lot of junk everywhere. I doubt he's using all of this on a regular basis. Um, there's a lot of flamingos, a lot of pink flamingos. So he's collecting them, but why is he collecting them? Is he, because if he's collecting them just to, I, I think he's, either he really likes flamingos or he's collecting them just to collect them. Like, oh, I gotta have some more flamingos. What's in here? It's like, Vladimir, do the mission. No, I'm psychoanalyzing this gentleman. What's in his garage? It's got a lawnmower. It looks like it has not been cleaned, and it probably just doesn't even look like it really works. Um, we can check. Has he been cutting his grass? He doesn't really have much grass. But with what, what grass he does have, he is definitely not cutting it. So uh, he doesn't care about his yard, which is fine. Not. I, I think it's kind of stupid that some people obsess over their yards. It's just grass. Um, but the, the neighborhood has to all look the same. What world are you living in? Um, okay. Some soldados let it slip that they're expecting a military supply drop nearby. You'll have to race to get there on time, Gorilla, but scouts honor it'll be worth your time. Attack, raid, and share. Just don't forget to thank the killer queen and her loyal knight, the bit and bishop. Okay. All right, campfire. Let's see his campfire. Oh, so he's just left beer out here. A whole bunch of bottles. He doesn't bother cleaning up his trash. He has a thermos out here that looks like it's been here for very long. He probably doesn't even remember he has it. He's probably went and bought a new one not knowing where his thermos was. Um, hmm. Man, this guy... Okay, he drinks a lot. And this is not a little bit of booze either. He's got a basketball. Does he have a hoop? He does. How used is it? Well, first of all, this guy's too big to be dunking on it. I'm just saying. No offense, but... And he's putting it on his his sat, his uh, radio tower, which is a horrible idea because then if you bounce on it, you could uh, just you know it's just it's just not a good idea. So um, 
I doubt he actually uses it, is my point. He has it there for when friends come over, so they think he works out. It's back here. Okay, so why is this lantern lit? Oh, he was just working on this. So right before I came over, he was probably over here with this lit light, trying to come up with some new graffiti styles. Um, you know, there's a lot... If this is all his graffiti and he's just writing everywhere... If it's for practice, that's one thing, but if he's just, like, writing out of boredom, he probably should see a counselor. Not that writing out of boredom is a bad thing, but if you're just, like, writing on everything, the ground, the walls, the ceiling, the floor, yeah, the ceiling. Yeah. It's usually not a good sign. Usually. I mean, it really just depends on the individual, but... Is this his bathroom? Weird. So he showers. His mirror doesn't work. He's never bothered cleaning it. Well, he brushes his teeth out here. So this is where he brushes his teeth, washes his hands, and showers. But where does he go to the bathroom? Does he go to the bathroom in the shower? I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. But... This episode on House Reviewers... Why do you put this up here? Man, so there's not really a lot of method. You could say that a lot of this junk, oh, he's being artistic about it, but no, there, it's just too randomly strewn about. This guy is a hoarder. He, uh, but why? Why is he hoarding? Let's see if we can figure that out. Well, okay, I'm having, I'm, I'm having deja vu all of a sudden. So he, his whole goal is to be, do a radio thing, right? And talk to people. Yet he has all of this junk in the collecting. He's holding on to things. I think the guy just wants to be heard. He, I think that he didn't get enough, most likely didn't get enough attention as a kid. It felt like no one ever listened to him. Maybe his friends growing up, maybe none of his friends listened to him. Maybe he was a kid that he would follow his friends around trying to talk to them, but they were just like, oh God, it's it's him. Let's just uh, kind of casually ignore him, but he still hangs out with us. I feel so bad for him. He's talking to himself in there. I'm very concerned about this poor guy now. Because he's not on the radio right now. He's just shouting out to himself. What, what, what's over here? Another note? Let's read it. Let's see if we can get into his head a little bit. Think you're fast? Prove it. There's a Grand Primo going down nearby. Check your map, pick up your phone, and win me a prize, Gorilla. Okay. It's, a, it's Guarilla, not Gorilla. Find Intel. So this is just Intel. This is not stuff he's writing. So he has an ATV. Has he graffitied on it? No, if it was his ATV, he would have graffitied on it. He just has dishes out here. So here's the thing. He doesn't have a lot of self-respect. Like, he really doesn't. And I think that part of the reason he doesn't have self-respect is probably because people didn't listen to him enough growing up. People didn't, his, maybe his, maybe he doesn't have parents, or maybe his parents ignored him. Maybe his parents didn't want him, and they and you could tell. Maybe they didn't tell him they didn't, that they didn't want him, but you can tell if your parent doesn't want you. Even if they say it's not, even if they uh, don't say it. Normally, a little bit of insight, you can kind of feel it. He said that earlier. What's he have above his bed? What? So people, what people care, put around their bed is usually something important to them. Usually, um, you see, you have two different types of people. You have the people who put their important pictures in their bedroom or on their nightstand or just where they want to look at it when they wake up, and then you have the people who want to put their important pictures in the main area that guests are over, so that guests will see the, what's important to them. Um, and those people usually care more about what other people think than about their actual um, place in the universe, usually. And and great, keep in mind, I'm generalizing a lot here. Because um, it all would depend on the individual. Um, is everyone has a different different reasons for what they do. Um, so he has a history book. Oh God, poorly written diary entry. Don't know why I. Oh, he can't spell. I guess things are going okay for one of the sizes. Danny is like my oh no, Danny is like my total hero. Once I feel useful, I found oh no, <laughs> I might all end tomorrow. Oh my god, I feel like I psychoanalyzed him so well. <laughs> oh man, I feel even worse now because I, I totally had him pinned. All right, well you know what guys, we're gonna be nice to this guy now because he needs it. Us being nice to him, going out of 
it's a good good advice for your life is if you ever pick up on someone that's like that instead of looking at them oh like if that person's pathetic maybe be their friend because that person will be your friend for life and you will always have another fellow human that'll have your back um and you'll you can often say those lives because oftentimes those are the people that end up you know taking things a little too far um when they get down so uh be those if you find those people be their friend What are you cooking up, man? What you got? Uh, almost. Welcome to Radio Libertad. Marquesa locked down the internet, so we're taking over the radio to give Libertad a voice. Sweet. So that's... old ass network is cock blocking me. It's from like, what, 1993? Hey, that's the, the year of me. The tower things around here shoot out the signals, but most of them are broken or point the wrong way. Mm. I tagged all the broken shit, fix and rotate them. For sure, yeah. What are you gonna, gonna give Yara the truth it needs? You give me a charm for my gun, bro. Pete, don't don't put charms on your guns. Look, uh, as your friend, I just want to tell you it's not cool. It's actually very lame. You, you got me? I think he's got me. All right. Other than that, bro, this is a great idea. I'm gonna help you out. We're gonna get these sit situated for you. By the way, I really like your Did pad. I ever tell you I love you, Danny? You took it too far. <laughs> oh my god. That's gonna hurt his self esteem. He put himself out on an emotional limb. Hold on. I love you too. Alright. <laughs> there, that'll make his day. But now I gotta be careful because he may take it too far now. I may have just opened the oh the plane. Uh, Alright, well you know what? We've 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 befriended this guy. <laughs> I should never have psychoanalyzed him. Now I feel like I feel entitled to help him. All right. Um, we're going to go ahead and end this episode here. In the next episode, we will help this this guy out. He is our new friend. He needs a friend more than um, more than you may know. So we're, we're going to help him out. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys had a great time. I had a fun time. And we'll see you in the next episode.